And evening, folks. This is your old pal, Uncle Al. Yeah, we had a wonderful day. Solar radiation, uh, disruption with the Wi-Fi, and a few other things. Iranian hackers, Chinese hackers, North Korean hackers, the guys from Romania. So anyway, it's September 24th. Hi, I'm your old pal, Uncle Al. All right, let's take off the glasses and put on our regular glasses. Okay, a lot of people were asking me uh, what's going on. Yeah, let's see. Okay, a lot of you don't understand this. Okay, monetary... Non-monetary inflation is caused by an event like the last three years. Uh, okay, like we had shortages because of the uh, disease and also people playing the market. Okay, that was that problem for three years. Next one is monetary inflation caused by bad government, corrupted bureaucrats, and electric, elect, elected officials. Example... Weimar Republic, Zimbabwe, USA from 2021 to 2024. Okay, so far it's 398 right and almost, well, I still got to figure out when it's either 13 or 14 wrong. So who's laughing at old Uncle Al now? Okay, oh, that way. All right, a lot of people don't understand uh, finances, monetary, or government. They just look stupid and just grueling all over themselves. Okay, let's see. Okay. Now, a lot of people are screaming a lot. I know these people are screaming price controls. That's communists and socialists. It didn't work for Nixon. That was a big problem with the United States. We were chugging along, finding Andy, and then Nixon and before him the Democrats were doing weird things. Okay? Didn't work for Mao. Didn't work for Stalin. Didn't work for Hitler. Doesn't work for anybody who's following the communist socialist plan. Maduro in uh, Venezuela. <laughs> Okay, doesn't work. Whatever the vice president's talking about, she's nuts. I don't like to get into politics, but I like to get into math. Okay, a lot of blue areas, you have to understand, especially L.A. and the Bay Area, don't understand this. All right, it's not only a federal issue, it's a state issue. Okay, you can check that out. All right, a lot of these business properties in the blue areas are losing money. Okay, money funds these operations, SSIs or investment, your savings, and pensions. Once that tax base is gone, guess what happens to this? You don't get any money. Okay, because a lot of people, but it's a pension. But who funds the pension? Okay? You don't have that skill level. But I went to college for four years and I got a master's degree. And you're still an idiot. All right? We're talking serious finances. And if they don't correct the problem, a lot of pensions, okay, EMT, fire, police, anybody who's working for a living is going to lose it. Same thing for savings and Social Security and investments because it goes to that tax from that tax base. Okay, this is not only state but federal. So think about it when you go to vote. Okay, uh, we have the Zoomer apocalypse. Uh, apocalypse. Zoomies, that's Eloy, those are the singing, dancing, uh, wimpy people. We have the Morlocks, that's the aggressive, 
uncontrollable, violent uh, gang herd mentality, screaming, Wolverines, let's kill everybody. Okay. And then we got the idiots. And we know who that. Only 40% will survive. 60% are dead, dying and dead. Can't help it. A lot of cat ladies, a lot of single women, urban single women. Sorry about that. Can't be helped. Now, if you notice, a lot of places are doing the QCO for hiring. That's against federal and state law. But a lot of places that do it, like Chipotle did that robot thing in California. It's a totally robot operation. They had a few faults. And they had to call the police because the robot says the guy did not pay for his bowl of food. What, what happened was the food came out, the robot scooped it, and then the bowl came out. All right? I don't think I wanted to pay for an empty bowl. All right, same thing with the Q code. All right, a lot of people don't understand that. That's a big problem with the tech industry. You have a lot of problems. You're supposed to have a landline, You're supposed to have paper copy, You're using a legal currency or form. Okay. And a lot of them, oh, we're not breaking the law. Oh, yes, you are. If Uncon does get some money and does litigation, I'm making a trillion dollars off of these people. Okay? Because a lot of people are stupid. Okay. Check out Chris Leon. She needs a lot of help. She needs the watch hours and go check out her videos on shorts. Okay? Uh, you can send her a gift card, DoorDash card. Uh, fast food cart always help. All right. Now, AI secret shadow band. Forced uh, unexcription. Observe age restriction. Refusing to notify you of new episodes or live streams. And keep showing valid or old past videos. Why? Because it's programmed like that. Okay. So remember when you check out Chris Leon, because Uncle Leon's a lot smarter than most people and a lot smarter than most college students. Now remember, a lot of people don't understand what I'm talking about, seriously. Go check out Michelle Mitten's Prepper. Remember what I told you about the AI? Michelle Mitten's Prepper needs to watch hours. Okay, check her out. You have to do a valid format, all right? Or the AI keeps showing your old episodes and your numbers and watch hours keep shrinking. Because the AI don't care, you're a number. I am not a number, okay? A lot of you are trapped in that 50 mile circle. You're expecting certain things and benefits, okay? But like I said, we're talking about inflation, price control, Okay, and shortages. Now where I put that? Uh, Uncle Alan has too much notes. Whoops. Okay. Okay, remember when I talked to you about price controls? The bad side effect is we get a lot of shortages, okay? When they start this, and they already did, we expected shortages. Right now, we're having a shortage of canned foods. I have a list, I told everybody, but it was one of the videos they took off, okay? That's why I'm short, okay? Then you have the black market, okay? Trouble with the black market, you don't know the quality or the safety of the food, but you still get it. And then, like China, Worldwide fake food. It could be plastic. It could be laced with fentanyl. It could be toxic as hell. Like those three million moon cakes that nobody can eat. And they were using as rat bait. Okay. Fake food. 
This is going on worldwide. And a lot of people don't understand this. Sorry, this is going to be a long one. Okay, watch the ungrateful peasant or Wayne G becoming dangerous. Nothing is normal anymore. Trust no one. You must comply. I'm not a number. No. I'm not going to comply. N O. No. Okay. How about cat complying because he lives in Canada? And you know who runs Canada. And it's not that guy. Okay. As we get closer in the next 48, uh, 43, wait, 40, 40 days, it's getting closer to the last winter from 2024 to 2025. Both winters, okay? Civil War, not like you think like North and South. No, this is going to be partisan uh, violence, like I told in the last video. Okay, invasion. A lot of people don't know the great naval battle of Lewiston, Ohio. Oh, no, wait. Out Idaho. The greatest naval battle ever fought in the United States is Lewiston, Idaho. Okay, deepest penetration of a foreign force. A lot of, nat of National Guard from Idaho and remaining of Oregon and Nevada fought tooth and nail, helped by the U.S. Coast Guard and Air Force. All right, they fought the invaders in Lewiston, I think it's Lewiston, Idaho. It's one of the it, bloody, and everybody were asking, where's the Army, where's the Navy, where's the Marines? Nobody showed up. Okay? Uh, crime, starvation, death, limited nuclear event. It's not nuclear war, it's a limited nuclear event. Keep telling that to people, but they don't understand. Alright, we lose 40% of a mil the military because of this. And we have many coups. Okay, it's coup time. We already did one, we got two more. Uh, getting old. Okay. Our world, Nazi world. And remember, leftists, liberals, fascists, academics will not survive the apocalypse. You're not Dorothy, this isn't the Wizard of Oz. Okay. As Rome burns, Brandon eats ice cream. Because of the food crisis and also a lot of people are putting their money down on the central bank digital currency, you're going to see a lot of animal gain rights. All right, look at Philadelphia. Okay, a lot of people don't understand what's going on. I do. All right, so we're going to have shortages. They're going to try the Democrats. We're going to try to do price control. It didn't work for Nixon. It didn't work for Mao. It did not work for Madeira. It doesn't work. Okay? You need a free market. All right? Unless you like to eat fake food and poison food or, or black market mess food, then it's fine. All right? Biggest problem right now is we have people that doesn't know what they're doing. They're putting their bets on their $3 trillion mistake on, <coughs> on digital currency. Central bank digital currency. That is a lie. Okay? They're trying to get rid of coin. All precious metal, all coin. They're trying to get rid of paper money. So all you have is a um, card. All right? And they say, we'll take care of you. And you'll have plenty of credits or units or whatever they give out. But the only problem with that is not real. Okay? It makes things a lot worse. All right? Another thing is, if they don't like you and you're the wrong kind of Asian or the wrong kind of race 
or the wrong kind of Jew or wrong kind of African American or Mexican American, they could stop payments. They could seize your assets. Okay, because it's all digital. They have control, they have power. You're their yellow Negro. People don't understand that remark. Uncle Tom's an old, old outlaw. And a good one too. Okay, remember, they're breaking a lot of rules so they can stay in power. So if you don't want to die, you go look at the vice president and you look how well she did the last three years and then you decide, am I going to die? All right, folks, Uncle Alan's getting a little tired. I'm going to do another short one, maybe tomorrow morning. Go check out my last three uh, shorts, okay? Because you could tell right off, been shadow banned by you know who. It's fairly easy. You could tell, like you can, you could tell. All right. Read the pinned comment below. I'm not kidding. Once I hit 5,000 on subscribers and 5,000 on videos, I'm leaving. You can play around and scream and yell and go into the concentration camps. Uh, shh, don't tell anybody. But Uncle Alan's tired. Uncle Alan's old. All right. I'm sorry these things are long because a lot of people get bored and they don't listen to old Uncle Al. That's fine. Just start digging your hole and compost. Anyway, grow a garden. Don't eat people. Because everybody thinks Uncle Old Uncle Al is a crazy old kook. That's fine. Think about that when you're breathing your last breath. Or starving to death because your rations by the government isn't enough. Okay? Number two. Get a mentor, learn how to stockpile, put away, learn all the tricks because old Uncle Alan's not going to be here too long. Number three, get a bike. I keep telling people this and they get, they give me, I could walk 40 miles. Yeah, you're going to see a lot of dead preppers and survivalists and a lot of YouTubers dead on the road. All right, folks, I'll catch you later. God bless and good luck. You'll be needing it. It's 2024. Bye now.